Hi guys, hi warriors! So this is our day 2 of the Zcat Power Cardio program that we're doing together. Yesterday we did number 1, workout number 1, checked. Today we're doing workout number 2. And before your workout, uh, if you're doing these workouts, I'm doing these workouts in the morning, so I have my breakfast before. Remember, your pre-workout meal should be uh, made out of protein and healthy fats. You can have carbs in forms of in the form of veggies and fruit, but no starchy carbs before your workout. Okay, no grains, no whole wheat bread, no pasta, no rice, nothing like that. Stick with protein and healthy fats and veggies and, and fruit. You can have your carbs after the workout, you know. So I have here my pre-workout meal is omelette, egg omelette. I use three eggs, some feta cheese, a little bit of tomatoes and green leaves. Shush! Dogs are barking. And because it's a big portion, I'm gonna eat just a half of it before my workout and I'm gonna leave the rest for for after the workout. Because I don't wanna wait too long for the food to digest. So, um, okay, also you have to drink a lot of water. Remember, these workouts are super intense and you're gonna, you're gonna need to keep yourself hydrated. So remember that. And now, okay, have your pre-workout meal. And get ready because we're gonna do the workout. So I'm ready to do my workout. I hope you guys are ready too. Remember that you should do your warm up before you start the workout. Today we're doing workout number two and it's a time challenge and today's workout is gonna take a little bit longer than the one that we did yesterday. On the DVD it takes 15 minutes 24 seconds. Now you have two options. You can um, either try to beat my time or you can try to uh, keep up with me. And now, if you have problems to keep up with me, then pace yourself. You know, um, we're doing several exercises, we're starting at 10 reps and it goes all the, way, all the way up to 70 reps. Try to go through the entire exercise, at least at the beginning, before you take the break. Try to take the break in between the exercises if you have to. Now, as you go into the higher reps, you might want to pace yourself and do 10 reps at a time, pause the video, do another 10 reps at a time, pause the video. You know, it's a video so you can pause it at any point that you want. You know, you can try to take a, take a break at any point that you want. But I would like to really encourage you to push at your max effort because that's what's going to bring you the results that you want. It's supposed to be a really, really intense workout. So, let's do this. Push really hard. Yay! <sighs> okay, guys. So, I just completed the workout and I managed to beat my time. It took me 13 minutes and 51 seconds. And now I'm about to move into my cool down and stretching. Now, I just wanted to tell you guys that you have to really pay attention to your form because you're doing there are high reps, very high reps. In, this workout and it's you know as you get tired your form might go south and you don't want that you know so if you feel like you know it's it's too hard and if you feel like you're not keeping a proper form then stop and take a breath and then uh, you know as you feel like you can push hard again then push hard really like it has to be of such a burst of energy but don't do it uh, to the point that you lose a, a, a lose a proper form because that's that's not good. You have to really pay attention to that. So that's what I wanted to tell you. And uh, you know, I was pacing myself too, even though I was beating my time. Uh, there were points that I did only like ten reps at the time. Then I walked around for a bit. Then I pushed hard again through the exercise and then took a uh, break a little bit. So I did, I'm doing the same thing, even though I'm pushing maybe harder through the exercises, I take breaks here and there. So that's what uh, helped me to go through this. Uh, and that's it. So now, cool down stretching. Don't forget that it's really important, you know, stretching after this workout. 
and then I'm gonna show you my post-workout meal. Okay. So now that you earned your carbs with your workout, you can eat any starchy carbs you want as a post-workout meal. I'm having my oatmeal and I have also throw in some Cheerios for my sweet tooth. You can do that after your workout, you know. So throughout the day, make sure that you are um, eating healthy, that you're eating the right meals. For fat loss, I suggest that you avoid starchy carbs during the day. Eat your starchy carbs only after your workout. So that way you're gonna speed up the process and you're gonna lose fat faster. So if you want more um, nutrition tips about food and stuff, I have tons of those tips on my website zuskalike.com and also I wanted to ask you guys um, if you have these DVDs and you're making progress and you're enjoying the workouts, please leave me a review on Amazon.com because it's going to help me a lot. And you can buy these DVDs on my website, zuskali.com, or you can buy it on Amazon. If you don't have them yet, don't worry because, you know, these videos are not going anywhere. You can start this program at any time. And, uh, you know, so that's it. And I will see you guys tomorrow because we're doing this on a daily basis. It's a month-long program. So jump on the wagon whenever you can. And I'll see you guys tomorrow. Ciao. Hi, I'm Zuska and I have taken my most effective moves and upgraded DVD cardio series that comes with 3 DVDs and 30 day fold out calendar that will guide you day by day to get you into the best shape ever.